Oh my god. Yo, how's it going, guys? We're here coming to you guys with a brand new video. And today, as you guys see by the title, I got the most dominant seven foot three center in 2k23 now before we get into the video i want to tell you guys that this is probably not going to be a park build so if you are here looking for a six foot eleven freaking power forward you know center for the park this is not for you click off um this is for i mean it could still be for the park but you're not going to be shooting threes you're not going to be a popper you're going to be more like of the traditional center kind of like a shack just freaking bullying everybody and being an inside score okay so before we get into the video make sure that you do leave a like do not forget to subscribe we're very close to 10k Follow all the stuff in the description down below, the freaking Twitter, the Instagram, and right there on the bottom left, shoprebo.com. If you guys want to cop some clothing, you could go ahead and go on there. I make it all myself, and some of the stuff is pretty cool. But let's go ahead and go straight into the video, okay? So, um, I was playing with this builder for uh, probably around two hours. You know, I was doing the power forward thing, uh, trying to make like six foot ten, six foot elevens. Um, then I went to centers, and I was doing like seven footers, seven foot ones, and then I'm like, let me just try the max. You know weight and the max height and the max wingspan you know the weight was a little too much so i was able to cut it down and i ma managed to come up with this build that's pretty cool and it has some pretty cool take as well so let's go ahead and go straight into the video i'm going to try to make it quick you guys really like the last lamello build and i'm currently working on another video for that um just showing like the highlights of that and i'm currently streaming it as well so if you guys want to see that the other build is very very good this is going to be more of my fun you know kick kick back and relax with the freaking center build okay so let's go ahead and go into it you're gonna make it a center doesn't matter the height 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 it's gonna be seven foot three 247 pounds and eight foot one wingspan the body shape doesn't matter but i have it at bill because he looks huge like that okay so let me tell you guys something real quick i put it at eight foot one wingspan because that's obviously the max he's seven foot three so this guy's gonna be insane i don't know i don't know mathematics maybe like freaking 11 feet he's gonna be going like that you know that's insane uh <laughs> let's go straight into it okay i already have it already built out so i'm not gonna waste my time talking for freaking um however long like five minutes i'm just gonna show you guys the build right here i'll go over it so you guys could listen very closely i'm gonna repeat it so you guys already got it seven three two forty seven eight foot one wingspan okay so starting at close shot 80 driving layup 38 driving dunk 58 standing dunk 94 post control 83 mid-range shot 41 three-point shot 26 free throw 66 pass accuracy 72 ball handle 37 interior defense 96 perimeter defense 47 a seal 50 block 94 offensive rebound 99 defensive rebound 91 now to the physicals speed 53 acceleration 40 strength 75 a vertical 70 and stamina 95 okay so you guys are probably gonna be like oh what am i supposed to do i can't shoot with this build what am you know what am i supposed to do with this i can't shoot i can't do anything now listen 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 little ones okay it does not matter that you can't shoot with this because if you're playing rec there's gonna be so many shooters that there's no reason a center should be there and in park you already got two other guys that are gonna be carrying you um shooting i mean obviously there's going to be some centers that are you're going to be playing against that are going to be 6 11 and they're going to be shooting but they're not going to be making every shot you know they rush into the paint you're blocking everything with that block with that offensive rebound um you got 30 defensive badges now i had 26 three point shot right there but you could just take that off uh, i told you guys 26 you could take that off and put it into free throw or something like that it really does not matter or you could put it into ball handle like 40 ball handle it really does not matter um i think that i'm going to go ahead and put uh, whatever that just was into let's see hold on uh you can put it into driving dunk vertical stamina you can put it into stamina um yeah i'm gonna put it into stamina instead so that three point shot leave it at 25 and put it into stamina so you have 96 stamina but that's how it looks you got 60 badges no shooting badges but um you know you got the freaking tallest max height the max wingspan and uh you have 75 strength so you are gonna have bronze bully if we go ahead and take a look at finishing uh, you are gonna have bronze bully which is still crazy because if you take a look at another badge in uh where is it defense right here uh gold anchor purple pogo stick and purple rebound chaser with gold brick wall that's actually kind of insane wait why don't i have a oh yeah no i don't have gold uh, interior defense you need 99 interior defense yeah it doesn't matter but look at that that's a build but i want to show you something pretty cool with the take um if we go ahead and move on to that why why is it not working why is it what am i missing oh there you go wait 
what am I missing? Literally, what am I missing on this? Why is it not working? Just play around with it. It doesn't matter. Freaking free throw one stamina. Doesn't matter. But that's how I have it right there. Okay, so you copied it. Now, I want to show you the takes. The primary take is super sick. I i don't know if they had this before, but look at this. See the future. Shows you where missed shots will land ahead of time, giving you the upper hand in chasing down boards. I've never seen that. I don't know if I'm a noob, if I'm a bot, but that looks pretty crazy. The fact that you could Dennis Rodman your way into rebounds and see where it's going to land, that's pretty cool. And if you have this uh, secondary take, power backdowns, increases your ability to back down even the strongest defenders in the post, so you're already the strongest. It's going to be insane. I can't wait to just mess around with this one and... Uh, level that up but let's go ahead and continue and let's see who we get shades of i'm hoping we get like rudy gobert uh hakeem or like Shaq or something like that yao ming oh my god will chamberlain you know anytime you get that that's pretty crazy so you get mitchell robinson rudy gobert like i said i wanted and will chamberlain oh that's like a defensive anchor hold on let me take a picture of that that's pretty cool will chamberlain that's super super sick now i really like that and I'm going to mess around with this build. If you have any other, you know, tips for this build on how to improve it, let me know. But this is for the traditional centers. Again, you're not going to get that freaking power forward six foot nine because I truly I've played a lot of rec already. I've played maybe like 15 games and every single time our center who's seven foot one has played against a power forward or like a six foot 11 center. They are getting dominated and it's mainly to do with the height. Obviously the height and he's got more strength on him. He's got more badges and you really don't need poppers i i don't think you need poppers it's very hard to shoot this year but let me know what you guys think leave a like if you enjoyed and comment down below what you guys want to see next thank you guys for watching and peace if you want real drip go to www.shoprevo.com ready to ship upon order all handmade just like you and me